24 year old woman is set to stand trial next week in Harding County in connection to an attack on an elderly woman. Now 24 year old Jessica Skates is charged with injury to the elderly causing serious bodily injury, a first degree felony. Investigators say Skates beat then 78 year old Ruby Cravey with a cane after Cravey let her into her home to help her. Tonight Cravey's family is speaking out. KFDM's Kara Dixon sat down with the relatives to hear why they want the community to remember what happened to their grandmother. This one is probably 2010, 2011. These photos of Kayla Wellborn and Michelle Shook's grandmother, Ruby Cravey, are reminders of happier times. She wouldn't help anybody now. No. A stark contrast between the independent woman they say would give the shirt off her back this is yes. the most to someone now confined to a wheelchair. She's having to be taken care of now. She can't live on her own and she still has no use of the left arm. She's still here. <laughs> Investigators say in October 2013, Cravey let then 23 year old Jessica Skates into her Silsby home after Skates asked for help. Cravey told her family she fell asleep and woke up to Skates beating her with a cane, yelling she was going to kill her. She suffered three concussions, a crushed elbow, a punctured lung, broken ribs, and had more than 50 staples put in her head. Since then, her relatives say she spent her time in and out of hospital. Skates is charged with injury to the elderly, causing serious bodily injury in connection with the crime and set to stand trial next week. Cravey's granddaughters say it's been a long two years waiting for what they call justice. She's ready to get this over with as much yes. as we are. She asks every time we see her if we've talked to them and, and what's the latest. The question this family is asking is one that's haunted them for nearly two years. In Silsby, Kara Dixon, KFDM 6 News. Jury selection will start Monday if convicted skates faces from probation to up to life in prison.